previously on Spyro. What are you? Oh, you're so creepy. So let's do this. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Fawn, the BEA beautiful legally blind individual that you see before you. When we last left off, we saved a couple of dragons. We, we destroyed a couple of people, got a couple of thieves. Like, you know, how we do. If you're new to the channel, I just want to say welcome, and if you're returning, I really appreciate it. But with that being said, let's start going into the next level, because we need to keep going. And of course, they start in a bunch of enemies. Alright. Where's the next place I gotta go? You. Is it you? Or is it... Oh, there's one over here. I remember this. I said I was gonna go in here. Go Spyro, go Spyro, go! Oh... It's like a winter wonderland. This is a big looking level too. <laughs> it looks like you got a paper bag on your head. <laughs> Loser. You came to us. We are the paper bag gang. What's up dude? Tell me about these paper bags. Word of caution, little one. Wait until you grow big, <clears throat> like me, before charging those large enemies. Yeah. I mean, it's not like I didn't know that before, but... When will I get big? Ow! I deserve an apology. As I just completely destroy you and your friend. Maybe I am the one who should apologize. Maybe I'm the villain. <laughs> oh. Achoo! What's up? Spyro, some big norks up ahead are wearing armor. And in the ice cave, armor can make their feet very slippery. Hmm. But the guy just told me not to charge them. Are you telling me to charge them? Also, can I do it? The answer is yes. Yes, I can. That's awesome. Shortcut. Excuse me. I know you're trying to be all cool and stuff for your friends, and that's cool, but I'm trying to save my homies. What's up, dragon? Thank you for releasing me. That's all I ask. Is it just a simple thank you, not a long speech? I don't want to miss a drag. Was there one over here? Or was it just him telling me that people were here? questions that I have okay either way I'm gonna make <laughs> oh. is that what he was talking about I feel like I'm yeah I am backtracking okay at least I'm getting the gems 
because if the guy that collects all the gems is in this one, I want to make sure I'm stockpiled because he devours them. I don't remember which one he comes in, but I remember he was a thief. He was a crook. I don't even remember his name. I'm sure he'll come back to me. Excuse me. Uh, I'll come back for you. I wanna see what's over here. With my parkour dragon legs. And excuse me. <laughs> Timber! Stop throwing stuff at me, man. Get out of here. Is there are two dragons left? All right, so where? There it is. Excuse me. Oh, you made him less less sparkly. He was gold at one point. Now he's just green. He's sickly green. Oh, now he's nothing. Well, he is something, he's just not. Mm. I feel really, I need to give him this, the foods. Alright, what is going on? You've done well, Spyro. Some dragons thought you weren't ready, but I knew they were wrong. I'm ready, alright. Uh, ready for what? Now I'm wondering what I'm supposed to be ready for. I know everybody's wrong. Oh, okay. If I go that way, what's over here though? Um, just chests. Got some life. Oh, that's a lot of extra lives right there. Is that where I'm supposed to glide to? Is that like a glide spot? Can that be a glide spot? I don't know how I would get to it. Well, I feel like this is good enough. I got all the dragons. Thanks for freeing me, Spyro. And now, where was I? You're quite welcome. Goodbye. You done good, Spyro. You done real good. Yes, I know. 100% on this part. I'm pretty awesome. All right, what does you have? Oh, that was a big ouchie. Okay, I'm ready for you this time. Mama didn't raise no fool. <laughs> oh man. You're insane. Okay, I'm just gonna go and... I'm, yeah, I'm just gonna go. You guys are going too crazy for me. I'll catch you later. Dr. 
Shem thinks he's so cool. You don't know what it's been like listening to him over and over. But I tell you one thing, he should watch his back. So what you're telling me is his back is vulnerable. That's what I'm getting out of it. Oh. Got your butt. <laughs> you silly man. You have no idea the power I hold. Okay, I don't hold that much power. Okay. I'm gonna hit you at the right point, right there. Right in your tushy. Right in your banunkanunk. Alright. I got you. Oh, okay. I need to jump right there. Yeah! You are done for! And that was a boss battle. Well, he did give me his Achilles heel. Oh, that just brings me all the way back down. All right, I guess I'll return home. You done good, Spyro. You beat another one. You should be proud. Thirty-two dragons saved. My goodness. Well, all right. Hello, balloon man. I can't believe how fast you found so much stolen treasure. Well, I'm pretty great at finding treasure. Let's be real. So what's up? Hop aboard for the Magic Crafters world if you're ready. Magic crafters, you say? Deal! Boink! Later, loser. Spyro, you are a savage! Did I make it to the magic crafters world? It looks like I did. This place looks awesome! Wow! Okay, I didn't realize it was gonna be like that. Okay, I'm going to be very upset if there's... That is unfair. You and I both know this. What? Oh. In hindsight, looking at him and just going, oh, might have been my downfall. How do I do it twice? How's that a thing? It just is. Okay, well, I'll let you live this time. You are just... Okay, you need to stop it. All right. Hello, good friend. Welcome to Magic Crafters. I want you to release the dragons, reclaim our treasure, and recover the eggs from those pesky blue thieves. That's a tall order. But you know what? I believe in myself. But with me believing in myself also comes in the next episode.